D Rich TV here at the CP3 National Middle School Combine. And to my right, I have the main man, Zion Hartman. How you feeling today? Great. I see you got the rock in your hand, man. What you about to do with it? Nah, I just like carrying the ball everywhere with me. Okay, man. Now, I talked to you a few months ago, but how's everything been since then throughout the summer? Uh, hard working with Pat the Rock, staying in the gym. I see everybody commenting on your pictures, wanting to know what you do to work out. Can you give them a little bit of sneak peek what you do every day? Mm. This, this a little bit of sneak peek? Nah, not really. You can't tell your secrets, huh? It's exclusive. It's exclusive. What do you think about the gear they gave you guys here today? Uh, it's nice. It's better than the last year. And I saw it last year. I wasn't here. I just saw it. Okay. What's, what number you got? Five. You like that number? It's all right. What number you usually wear? Three. Three? Mm -hmm. What you know about Chris Paul? He from Western Salem. Man, he a good point guard. What do you rank Chris Paul among the top point guards in the NBA? I think he the best point guard for his IQ and the way he controls his team and run the floor. I think he the best. Okay, and now next year, what do you see the Clippers doing? What you see them doing? Because I think they can make it out the West possibly. I think San Antonio probably got the best chance, but I think the Clippers can do it. What you think? I don't know. Um, they're going to make the playoffs and all that, but I don't know how far they're going to get. Nah, man, there's a lot of people out here that's, that hate on you. You know what I mean? There's a lot of haters out here, and I want you to address that, man. A lot of people always got something to say because you rank number one, and they want to come take your spot, and you show out, and then they want to hate on you. What you got to say to those haters out there, man? Just keep working. I'm going to keep working. You got to keep working. You can hate all you want. I'm going to just keep working. What's your favorite school subject, man? Math. Why math? I just like all the equations, and you got, I don't know, I just like math. Uh, now, coming up in two weeks, what can we expect at the league finals, man? Are you guys going to win it? Oh, yeah. We ain't, we ain't lose all year. We're we not going to lose. What about George Hill? Yeah, I mean, what's the George Hill Rising Stars? Is that, ain't that a team that's pretty good? Yeah, they, they, the, they was our toughest team that we played all year that I think that uh, came closest to beat us, but, nah, we ain't going to lose. Now, I know you went to the Peach Jam. How was that experience? It was live. I liked it. It was because saw people get dunked on, college coaches, Maestro Skessi, Tom Izzo, different people there. Good experience. Now, what's some of your favorite colleges? I know you, you ain't got to give me a list, but what's some of your favorite colleges that you watch all the time? Kansas, Duke, um, who else? UNC, different colleges. I know you probably haven't talked to any college coaches, but what's your favorite coach that you see on TV? Coach K? Who? Uh, yeah, Coach K. From Duke. Yeah, yeah, Duke probably gonna win it all again next year too, man. Who was? Did you watch the NBA draft this past summer? Nah. Uh -uh. Who you think was the best player in the draft, though? Uh, I don't watch the draft. <laughs> D'Angelo Russell was my favorite, man. Well, what can we expect from this weekend? Buckets. Buckets. Go out there, ball up. Shout out Yank Scott. Hey, man, highlights. I'll say it for you, man. Yeah. <laughs>